Welcome back ladies and gentlemen, this is James and we're continuing our playthrough of Grand Theft Auto 5. In the last episode, we did the prologue where we robbed a bank in North Plankton, North Plankton, North Yankton, and um, crap. I didn't mean to hit the button there. And we saw two people get shot, one dead, and one basically faked their death. But we'll get into the one that's dead. Well, the one that faked their death and why it all happened. Much later on in the game. And we'll see exactly what was supposed to go down later as well. But in this episode, you see me and you see Franklin and Lamar, two people we met at the end of the last episode, boosting two cars. They work for a car dealership guy by the name of Simeon Uterian. And, um,. Apparently someone did not pay their note and we're supposed to repo them, but this ain't technically a repo job. We're actually stealing them. So, um, as you see here, I'm in what the game calls um, precise driving mode. Basically what it does is it slows down the game to where you can do special abilities easier and the uh, special ability for um, Franklin here is the precise driving um, Now right here a lot of people like to drive fast over these hills. I choose not to because I would wind up on my roof if I did because I ain't good enough of a driver to be able to control them. Um, but Ooh, someone clipped me. But one thing I forgot to mention in the first episode. Oh, crap. I'm going the wrong way. Is the fact that I, when I do these missions and stuff, I don't aim for gold. I aim to get them completed and that's it. Um, but as I mean, some of the stuff that's being said, we're going to listen to this part here. Is not really important, so we'll just bypass that. And when we do, we are wanted by the cops. So basically, what we got to do is lose the cops. Now, early in the game, it's actually fairly simple to lose the cops. Once we get later on in the game, it does get it does get a little harder. Whoa. Um, but we should have flashing stars now. See, we got our star level up there flashing, which means the cops cannot see us. And we see cop lights on our little map down there, which lets us know which way we can 
and cannot go to basically keep the cops um, where they cannot see us. And you see we have lost them, so we're just going to pull up here behind the dealership. And we're going to come out and we're going to talk, meet two more characters in the game. We're going to meet um, Simeon Yatarian, the bald, old bald-headed guy there. And Jimmy DeSanta. Now some of us may look at this character and think, hey, that guy looks um somewhat familiar to us. Well, he should, because in the early 90s, for those of us who were raised back then, on a show called you know, on Nickelodeon, the guy who was playing Jimmy in this game played on all of that, The Adventures of Pete and Pete, and he made appearances on a Nickelodeon game show called Figure It Out. And for those of y'all who know, of course, I'm talking about Danny Tamborelli. If you don't know who Danny Tamborelli is, you were not raised in the 90s. Um, now here, um, every character has their own unique vehicle. Um, Franklin's is called a... Um, Buffalo Bravado, a Bravado Buffalo, yes, I'm sorry. And um, it's an all right car. When we actually start doing street races, which we are, I am going to record the first one of those. Um, it is fast enough to do all the, the street races. Um, but let's go ahead, pull up in here, get out. And y'all, once again, I'm going to apologize for the terrible language that's in this game. I, I don't like it, but it's what video games has come down to. And we walk inside our little safe house. And we're going to get a short, smaller tour of the house. Uh, this is the little green first aid kit there. That's what we would use to replenish, replenish our health. Um, this is Franklin's bedroom where we can sleep and save the game. And when we sleep, I believe, um, Michael sleeps for six hours, Franklin for eight, Trevor for twelve. We can change our wardrobe. Yes, we want to auto save. Um, and y'all, that is going to do it for this episode. Once again, this has been James saying thank you so much for watching. Hit that like button if you would. Comment if you would like. And subscribe. And come back and join me next time. As we have yet another mission to do for Simeon in Grand Theft Auto 5. Y'all have a good one.